What's going on everybody and my name is Eric and today's vlog video is a student loan payment update. If you have not been following my channel, about every two weeks I go through my income coming in, add it all up, do the CP math, throw that big chunk or little chunk depending towards my student loans. This is what I've owed since July 4th, 2017. It was 66,000 something something dollars for going to pharmacy school. And this is what I currently owe as of yesterday when I filmed this video. $53,029 and some change. We have made a lot of progress chipping away at these loans with my itty bitty eBay, Amazon, Etsy pickaxe that I have. But before we get into the income, today's video is sponsored. Yes, they are now sponsored by consistency. Doing things over and over again, regardless of if they help your body, help your wallet, hurt your body or hurt your wallet. For instance, smoking a cigarette every morning, very consistent, not good for your body, not good for your wallet. However, waking up, walking around the block during sunrise, 30 minutes on the treadmill, consistency that helps your body, helps your wallet, and will help your mind. Enough of that, let's get into the income. First amount of income was a little bit of baby income coming from Etsy. One for $14.30, the other for $81.76. I will put a total here. Second income came from Amazon. I got a $540.12 disbursement. They already took out their their shipping fees, their Amazon fees, returns were already taken into account. Amazon just deposited this into my bank account. So thank you very much, Amazon. This complicated mess of eBay, I'm gonna to try to explain to everybody. $1,813.66 came into eBay sales. eBay fees and shipping, $457.56. And I also had a bunch of buyer messages hit me if you watch the vlogs over and over and over again, same day. So these are expected returns. A big camera I'm expecting to get returned for $315. A video game for $130. A pair of headphones for $63. A shirt for $29. And another game for $12. All those returns, a little over half a grand, $549. We're gonna take that out because we're anticipating having to pay that money back. My student loans hit me with an auto debit every single month around the 24th of the month. That was $354.77. We're gonna take that out of the total. And if my CP math was right before doing this video, $1,087.91 is what we're gonna be paying towards the student loans today. I kept saying late model Prius. Late model Prius. Another late model Prius. That is another really good condition, late model Prius. And I, for whatever reason, nobody corrected me yet, but late model means like newer. I thought late model meant like older. I kept calling it like a late model Prius payment, but it was not, it was a old model Prius. About $3,500 can get you like an older Prius. I feel like an idiot. Let me take you guys to the computer. We're gonna go do a payment. We got 1,087.91 to put towards the loans. According to my list, I've been going back to every two weeks. I, I'm on loan I with the highest interest rate. So we're gonna put it all towards I. We're not getting anything paid off today, unfortunately. J did not come back from the dead, which is good. Warning, your total payment exceeds $1,000. Do not pay. Well, we're gonna pay. Let's do it. Paying it up, being responsible, getting in good habits, being consistent. $1,087.91 going towards loan I. If you enjoyed this video the slightest bit, make sure to give the video a thumbs up. If you have any questions or encouraging comments or debt payoff stories, I would love to hear them. Thanks everybody for watching. I appreciate it and I will talk to you guys in the morning. What are we doing tomorrow? I don't know. Bye.